now let us see before proceeding further I want to show you how to find the methods available for the object once we have created so suppose we have created a is equal to 5 now a is a object so now how to find the object or let us say b is equal to rock and let us say puts hello so we are b dot c a l l so once the object is created we are using the method so how to find the methods available so for that there is a one more method called methods so for proc these are all the methods available you can use so see here there is a method called lambda we can check whether it is a lambda or not so like this we can freeze it so these are all the methods you can use and let us see what are all the methods for the integer so a is a integer let us see so like this once created any object you can search for methods so these are all the methods you can find the size like a dot s size z e it will give the size 4 is the 4 bytes is the size of the integer and so let us say c is equal to any string now c dot methods what are the methods available for the string all these methods are available we have seen some of them so we have seen like reverse for the string we have seen the chomp chop methods so for this also we can size size is 5 so instead of writing a dot method we can also give any value like 55 dot methods 5 these are all the methods available for the let us say 5 dot method methods so these are all the methods for the integer so even the integer value 5 is a object that's why if you remember we have used 5 times do puts we have written this hello and new line see here this is a method this is an integer this is a method let us see where this is available So we can find it actually there are a lot of methods available let us first execute this one and see like this five times this is also a method you can find it here and so here somewhere there is a method called times so for that let us say five dot methods dot short this will be giving in ascending order now we can search this t so here it is the times like this we can find the methods of any object once created whether it is a default or user defined class and and we have discussed like the lambda proc and proc new i want to show a small example so we, in this example actually you can use any of them let us say square is equal to lambda and getting the value of n and puts n star n we can also <coughs> write like let us make it little bit readability for sake of little bit readability let us say one more variable b is equal to n multiplication of n and now let us put square of lambda n is interpolation b so now let us call square and c a l l passing the value 5 first time 
now let us execute it it will give the 25 so square of 5 is 25 like this instead of this we can use proc let us change the value to 6 now execute it the square of 6 is 36 all are same in this example i will be showing only one difference in the next video save it let us change this to 7 execute it the square of 7 is 49 hope you understood and to find the method this one see call let us one more time let us see what is the method for the proc let us say keep it empty a dot methods so a dot methods dot short see here call this method we are using so this is how we can find the method so in this also there is a lambda hope you understood how to find the method and how you can use these blocks as a as a object and call them so see you in the next video